Good morning. Hello. How are you today? Good, thanks. I'm looking for fresh eggs. I understand you are a great source of fresh eggs. <laughs> You've come to the right place. Cool. Cool. Okay, I'm going to be making um, a frittata. Okay. And I know that when I use fresh eggs, not the ones bought in the grocery store who have been there for probably a month, three weeks to a month, that uh, they're good. it still makes good frittata, but nothing being real close to the nest to have These a great, are very close to the a nest. great In uh, fact, flavor. I can give you a dozen eggs that came, that I got from the hen house last night, so they wow. are probably about 24 hours old. <laughs> that is terrific. That and, is terrific. And when I collect, we each have chickens, and when I collect my eggs, I have to do battle with a couple of the hens because they don't like me collecting their eggs. And so I put my heavy gloves on, I pull down my sleeve. Do they come they, after you? They come after me, and they're very, they'll draw blood. Draw blood? Yeah. Oh, wow. They, they're they very protective of their eggs. Yes, well, I guess yeah. I can understand that. I can understand that. <laughs> yeah, they're Rudy, even now, I want, this is, of course, not our egg carton, but I just wanted to show you that you will have quite an assortment of colors and <gasps> sizes. Look at and those. Yeah, those they're, are. They're kind of blue. They are, a little bluish green. And these are the these are the new chickens that have just started laying, so they're smaller. Oh, I didn't know that. So yes. the eggs have, they, they get bigger. They get bigger, I guess, as the hen gets bigger. Yeah. Oh, wow, that's fascinating. And the blue and green ones are from eggs called, um, chickens called Araucanas. Araucanas. And, and, and we've been told that the way you can tell the color of the egg is you look at a chicken's ears. <laughs> You're kidding. I'm me. totally serious. And the skin, the color of the skin is the color of their egg. Well, first of all, I didn't know chickens <laughs> had ears. I mean, I never thought about it. <laughs> You're having me think about chicken and eggs right, all right. different. Yes, that's yes. right. Well, this is <laughs> very exciting to get Very good. fresh and very yellow. And the other thing you'll notice when you crack them is the, the, the white doesn't run like it does in a, oh. in a grocery store bought egg. The, white stays very close. close. Well, I know that if you're ordering breakfast out and you want eggs, that you should do uh, ask for poached eggs because that's supposed to be... Oh. Old eggs supposedly won't poach very well. Oh, that's I'm interesting. So, so I'm thinking the white has something to do it because when you put them... Well, that's very poaching, interesting. It just runs all across the water when you're poaching them. And by the same token, really fresh eggs don't hard boil very well. And they really? stick to the shell. And yeah. So you really are better off setting a dozen aside, like at Easter time, yeah. for a week or two, and before you hard boil them, the real fresh ones just um, the, too fresh. the the white sticks oh, wow. to the shell when you peel yeah. them. That's interesting. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I always wonder all why some peel easily yes. and some don't. Yeah, well, it ha doesn't have to do with the, a little layer of air or something between that the little membrane, the membrane between the wow. yolk and the shell. So well, very neat. <laughs> well, and that's how I got a whole lesson. That's what's great. We've got going to a local farm store. You find out stuff you didn't know. Yes, um, yes. When you grew up in the suburbs, and that's you true. Just used to go. I grew the up in the suburbs too, but I since since living in Maine, we've had chickens for probably thirty-five yeah. years. So. Oh wow! And yeah. I just made two frittatas this week from, <laughs> with our eggs. So. But they're yummy. The it was it was delicious. Yes. The thing about a frittata, you could make it different every time. Right. Well, well thank you very much. Thank you for coming. Come again. I will. Thank you. And I'm at the name of your farm stand is Bessie's Best Farm Goods in Freeport, Maine. In Freeport. Yes. That's right. Thank you. Well, thanks for coming. Thank you thank for you. coming. You're welcome.